Good morning! I am gonna make some coffee and get started. We're gonna do an iced espresso shot. I was gonna have Cheerios for breakfast, but there's only enough oat milk for either iced coffee or Cheerios. And there is shelf stable oat milk, but it's not cold. I just put it in the fridge. You're talking to me the camera. No, I'm talking to the camera. I just, it's just awkward because he's right there. Chat, she needs to drink the, or kind of thing I want to say. Eat the damn oat milk. That's what I want. Eat the oat milk? Or dry cereal? Is that what you want me to do? Huh? No, the, the milk that's warm. Ew! You want oh, to put warm milk in my Cheerios? It's literally fine. Mm, I'd rather put ice water in my Cheerios. You know, there was one time my dad put water in our fucking cereal. Cool. Why? Were you out of milk and you wanted cereal so he thought you wouldn't notice? Yeah. I don't know. He... <laughs> yeah, that's what he wanted to eat, but he just like said, this is what we got. He just gave it to you. He didn't even ask, is it okay if it's with water? Yeah. Oh my goodness. So did you eat it? No. It was gross. It was honeycomb cereal too, I remember. Yeah. Oh shit. God damn, I'm kinda guilt. Sorry. She really should just use the milk though. The warm milk. What? Nothing, <laughs> I love you. I love you. That's right. This is a very hectic start to the vlog. I'm gonna go. Goodbye. Do my makeup. It's Saturday. We're going to maybe buy a lawnmower today. So we're gonna go to probably Lowe's, Home Depot, maybe um, Menards, whatever it is. This is some laminate floor that was put on. This is the real hardwood floor, like the oh, original yeah. hardwood floor. It was painted black oh, and so. then these like tiles were put on top. And I've just been working on getting those off. They're really sticky. So I picked up some of this adhesive remover. It says that it works on carpets and vinyl flooring. It is a concentrate, so you're supposed to dilute it one to four. I'm not sure if I want to dilute it because I'm worried that once I dilute it, it'll be like too diluted and it won't be strong enough, but I'm so I'm gonna try and then see. So I'm gonna start with this like landing area, the stairs are behind you, and then we can go down the stairs and keep doing those, but I think what I want to do is take all the laminate off in one go and then do the remover. And then if that doesn't work, I did do four little pieces last night and I used Astone. The Astone did work. It was just a lot, like it took a lot of scrubbing and there were a lot of fumes and stuff, which this will probably have fumes. I have a respirator I can wear if it's bad. 
So uh, cue the montage. <laughs> It's not doing anything. That stuff that I put on there. I'm going to put some acetone down on some areas that I didn't put the laminate remover because I used acetone yeah. yesterday and I think it worked better than this remover. So I'm just gonna try it and then so I can compare. Also, like I feel like the stuff that I put down, I feel like it is already dry, so at least the point in. Waiting. I'll have to see what it says to do next, like after I wait one to two hours, so I have to like... I, I thought I said to scrape it up, but I'm having a really hard time scraping, especially since I don't want to damage the floors. I would rather use like a sponge or a brush, but I might have to run to the store actually and get a nice big brush because the only one that I have is this, and I don't want to... Like that's just so small. I'd rather have like a bigger one. Yeah, I honestly think acetone might be in the move. Unfortunately. Also, I think that is just called adhesive remover, so the type of adhesive we have might just not be working. I can't see what I'm doing. I need more of these sponges. This is what's working the best now um, to get the acetone off with the um, with the like goo. And then also it is taking off some of the paint. I'm a little bit worried that if it's taking off paint, it might also be taking off the finish on the wood maybe a little bit, but I think it's worth it because I need to get this done tonight. It's already four o'clock. I have to get this done tonight so the cats can come out. So I'm gonna run to the store and get more of these because this is my last one. And I'm also gonna look for like a bigger brush that has like really tough bristles because I think that will also work well. I wish I had recorded the audio when I was checking out because I got just the root beer. I ended up getting this brush because it's a dollar and the other one was like six or seven dollars. And since I got the mop that had that the brush on the end, I was like, I'll just, I'll probably primarily use that one. And then for like spots, I'll just use this one. So I didn't need to spend that much money. And he goes, okay, your totals 31. He's like, is that the total you're expecting? And I was like, oh, well, the root beer was two sixty nine, the brush was a dollar, the mop was twenty five, and he goes, oh wow, I wasn't expecting that. And I'm like, yeah, I wasn't either. But then I had to go away on my rant and be like, I'm cleaning laminate glue off my floors. I've been doing it all day. It's not coming off. I said my back is killing me, and he goes, oh, it's worth the price to save you the pain tomorrow. <laughs> 
But I feel like such a wimp saying, oh, my back hurts. Like, I'm such a little complainer. But, like, I am sore. It's just, there's no comfortable way to, like, screw up at it. I don't know. I should have, if I would have known it was going to be this difficult, I would have just done, like, a few pieces. And then that way I can just take off, like, a few tiles, like, at a time. And I wouldn't have done all of it. And I actually thought I was going to get the stairs done today. I don't know. But... Hopefully, honestly, I think like the worst of it's done. Let's go home. to save my back. Now my arms are cramping. I was not expecting this. Oh my God. I was not expecting this at all. I thought this will be a quick little project and then and then I'll do the rest of the stairs and, and then I'll go run some errands and clean the house. It's 5.30. Getting the tiles out helped the smell though because the previous owners were dog breeders and smokers. They only smoked outside so it's not you know, too bad, but um, the dog smell you can really smell. Also, like the strip by like going into the bedroom, going into the bathroom on like this side, wasn't painted as dark or something. Like, for whatever reason, this is more wood like, and then over there, it's like all the way black. There's almost like a gradient of like super dark black to no black. I don't know what that's about. Maybe somebody tried to remove the paint and just didn't do it all the way. Part of me wants to like mop, get it clean, let it dry, and then see where adhesive is still at and just like pick up that adhesive. And then that way too, once like the chemicals are up, I can let the cats out. I think they would like that. So I'm meowing in their playroom right now. <laughs> So I'm gonna let the cats out. I did have to put this rug down because it's still like super sticky. If I would have known it was going to be this sticky, I would have focused on this bedroom 
to the stairs area. Yeah, this is like a big mess. <laughs> Oops. As you may have noticed, this video is probably really boring and I've done like basically nothing. So to save this video, it's 7.30, the day is over. So to save the video, I'm making loaded nachos. This is rice, that's about done. And then I'm chopping up an onion and a bell pepper and I'm making cashew queso. <laughs> I mentioned it in my last video and it's basically like a microwave rice bag you just open it a little bit and then microwave it for two minutes one minute 60 seconds and I'm gonna put this in there it does not look appetizing at all but it's just like a topping so it's fine And then we have the corn salsa, guacamole. I added an extra avocado to this, so this is three avocados. Peppers and onions, can you see it? Yeah. And rice. For me, the cashew queso is the star of the show. How it's looking. Oh my goodness. So good. 
Hopefully this made up for the boring video. Thank you for watching. I appreciate you so much. I love you. Bye.